A lot of you are going to go back to having your old life. Some of you guys are going to go back and you're going to be like, you know, yeah, this is good. I'm so motivated. I'm so driven. This is what I'm going to And then all of a sudden, it's going to get hard and you're going to fall back to who you were. I had a childhood. I don't remember my childhood very often. I have a I have a half sister and she's messed up in the head and she's always telling me, how do you forgive everybody? How do you have this life? How could you forgive our mom for mistreating us? How do you how do you live that way? How how are you not angry? I'm like, I don't think about it. Like, I'm just, I'm past that. I forgive, I move on. I have my life. Some people live in the past in that bitterness so much that it doesn't allow them to grow. It doesn't allow them to get to that next level. Sierra doesn't live that way. She forgave him. And I can almost guarantee you that when they get into a fight, she does not remind him of what she forgave him for. And they're just moving on. So getting historical is a big deal. If you're going to forgive each other in your marriage, in your relationships, you do not get historical. You don't talk about that. You've shared that pressure together. You really forgave your, each other and you're moving forward. Those are the kind of things that break families apart. Getting historical. You cannot get historical with a person you love. If you think you were stupid to forgive them, you shouldn't forgive them in the first place. So that's, that's, a, that's a big, big deal. And sometimes the person that get historical is you. Okay, sometimes things are going good in your life and you find a way to talk yourself into the person that you were before. Sometimes as you start, it, a lot of you guys are going to leave here today and you're going to be like, hey, I feel good. I'm a new person. I'm going to fight harder. And he gave you so many golden nuggets today. A lot of you are going to go back to having your old life. Some of you guys are going to go back and you're going to be like, you know, yeah, this is good. I'm so motivated. I'm so driven. This is what I'm going to. And then all of a sudden it's going to get harder. You're going to fall back to who you were. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy. A lot of you leave comments telling me that you need help. Do me a favor, I'm gonna tell you the best way to get a hold of me. Shoot me a text message right now, 918-210-0254. 918-210-0254. I'll help you with whatever you need. I got your back for life. Let's get back to the video. Why are you here? How are you gonna sustain what you learn? How are you gonna get through those testing times and move past it and be able to keep growing? What's the difference between successful people and us? If you think people that are successful didn't go through some hard shit, they keep overcoming. They don't wait for things to be perfect. They just keep going and rolling with the punches and they have more problems and they learn to deal with certain things. Fill your day up with a lot of and you won't worry about stupid I used to worry about my kids' hair being perfect, okay? I don't care about their hair being perfect anymore. I got too much that I worry about, that I don't care about the hair being perfect. You know, sometimes we worry and get stuck on so many details that it doesn't allow us to grow. You know why you worry about what people think about you? You don't have no to do. <laughs> Go change some lives. Go do some things that are meaningful. You won't care about what anybody else thinks. Andy and I don't give a shit what anybody thinks. If you align with what we're wanting to do, then good. We're together. If you're not, see ya. Next. That's our life. Be real. Be who you want to be. So many people aren't up. Don't move forward just because they're so caught up with what people think about them. So, you know, it's just having a double standard is a very, very, very big thing with us. You can't have that double standard. I mean, there's so much I can go. I can go on and on and on and on and on and on and on. I mean, there's so much. I wrote this book. I don't know how much time we have. It's already 6:20. How far do you want me to go? I can go on forever. Are you guys cool for 10 more minutes? Yeah. Hey guys, I just want to tell you you're the true one percenters. You made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.